Hello, welcome to Storytime Productions. I'm going to teach you how to one man bandit using Ugratone Cult Drums. You can also do this for any type of drum sampler, like MT Power Kit, uh, Easy Drummer, Superior Drummer, addic Addictive Drums. Uh, first, you want to have all your folders correct, you want to have it installed correct. So when you go to FL Studio, you go to your sequencer, insert, more plugins, cold drums too. Now I don't, I don't have the MIDI grooves on here, so what I did was I made a MIDI groove folder of all the MIDI kits I found. Uh, most from Easy Drummer, but some of them are MIDI packs from Ugratone. So this, this is how I do it. For instance, let's, uh, let's splash a black band beat on there. There we go. Simple. Get another one. Okay, let's go breakdown pack. Alright, that's enough for now just to show you. Go to cult drums. Look at this. Processing. Auto map outputs. Now I don't know why it doesn't go to one, but you gotta make that one, two, three, four. Back to Cult Drums, Output, Mega Mix, go to the FL Studio Mixer, press play. Ooh, there it is. Now you can splash all the effects you want on it. These one, two, three, four, five are all like overhead mics. This is your kick, the one snare, uh, cymbals somewhere in here. So, there you have it. And if you want to do a song, alright, here we go, do a song. That is, uh, you can do a sound track too. Send the bass, uh, add some. Reverb to a sand track. I'll tell this sand. Make it in color. Sand. Okay, reverb on there. I got blood over here. Rub the kick over here. There we go. It's in there too. And you can go to the main channel, compressor, all that. I'll show you how you can change it to another channel, replace, more plugins, MT powered drum kit. This is free. See? And to put these in the mixer, you want to, same thing, processing, all my outputs. Right on five. 
Bell on six. Crash seven. drum sampler in FL Studio and route it to the main mixer. Then once you do all that, you can export it as a WAV file, MP3 file, and then you can come in here and you can load your VST plugin. Start recording. There you go. Thanks for watching.